All right, everyone, welcome back to some more of those, I guess, exotic legendary weapons. Oop, weapon gameplays within Destiny, guys. Now, this really is, this is, this isn't a legendary, but it's very, it's more than that. Let's say that much by a lot. And it is called Edelin's, oh, Edelin's Ally. Now, this is the upgraded version of the Husk of the Pit. And the next upgrade to this gun is is the Necrochasm, which is the greatest gun in Destiny, um, said by Bungie themselves. And you need the Crux of Crota to even get that, which you have to defeat Crota on the hard difficulty of the raid, which comes out in January, a week and a half away. But here we go, guys. This is Edelin's Ally. Now, to get the Husk of the Pit, I made a video on that, so go watch that, and you can get all that done. So here we go. We thought it was intimate, but it has grown changed. Ghost refuses to analyze it further, but I sec secretly believe it has become my friend. Now, this gun, as you can tell, it looks like the Murmur a lot. Every, I mean, the big guns in, within this new DLC looks like the same gun. It looks like the Hive. And as you can tell, in this one, it does just looks just like it. In a second, you'll see what I'm talking about even more. Now, to upgrade this, you need a Senna Energy, the Crux of Crota, and spin metal and as you can tell the rate of fire is maxed out and the impact is hardly anything but in a second guys you will see that it does not matter with this gun it's one of the very very rare guns that does not require high impact with a high rate of fire gun and you'll see in a second the range is decent stability reload is always there. like just regular guns basically that has high rate of fire for the abilities, you got Cascade and melee kills increase reload speed of this weapon for a short time. This actually is a very useful ability. You wouldn't you wouldn't think it is, but surprisingly, it really, really is, and it will save your life sometimes, so you don't get that um, death now and then. Range Finder aiming this weapon increases its effective range, which is actually an amazing ability with this gun. It's gonna help it out so much because you can tell the range is still low. And if I equip this one right here, the aggress um, aggressive ballistics. The impact will raise and stability will raise. And I could even upgrade even more with some of the fitted stock if I want to. And with this, it's going to be an amazing gun overall. And here we go. Let's go straight to the gun itself and some gameplay. And you'll see what I'm talking about. Here we go. As you can tell right from the scope, it looks just like the murmur. As the, like the little reticule does, how it looks overhead. Everything looks just like it, just different skin. So let's go down here and see the damage of this thing and see everything this gun is up to. So, but really, guys, it is an amazing, an amazing rifle. And here we go. So for an Elder Vandal level 30, it does 56 damage to the body and 140 <laughs> damage to the head. And as you can tell, if I hold it down, I am just going to just, it's quick. It's so quick. I mean, it is just empties a clip. And as you can tell, the bullets look cool, like little like needles it looks like a like a little bit it looks like needles and it just really just destroy anything i'm not gonna lie it's like super rate of fire very high rate you got 42 bullets and if they're critical shots you're gonna kill a lot of stuff very quick i mean look at this i mean look at how many bullets i do have and i just ran through these guys without them only even touching me i mean that is just insane so let's go up here to the big guy Against the body, it's 56 again and 70 to the head. And I can just unload my whole clip into him and just reload it right back into it. And if I melee someone, um, it's going to be even quicker. And really, guys, you can just tell. It's, just, it's an incredible um, auto rifle. For what it is, it's amazing. And I cannot wait to get the Necrochasm, Necrochasm to actually see what that gun does overall. Because it's going to be cool. I know it's going to be cool. Um, I cannot wait to see that. Ooh, that glitch is still working, man. The it's a glitch right now, huge bug. That if I turn them visible while a hunter, they still know where I'm at, and they follow me around. They actually follow me around till I go on invisible again, and they just wreck me. It's a horrible, horrible bug <laughs> for the hunters, and I hope they fix it pretty soon. But as you can tell, I'm just I really they can't really do nothing. I mean, it's just it's just good, and I still got so many bullets left. I mean, I know a certain guns, like if I get this out right here, this icebreaker, boom, 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 <laughs> he's going to be dead pretty soon, but I want to get the kills with this thing. But um, I bet for an auto rifle, guys, you got to think about it. This is a very good one. 
The damage of it is insane, and it's good. For what it is, you have to think, guys, just of what this gun will be. And once I get the um, damage upgrades on it and all the other upgrades, it's going to be a very good contender for a lot of stuff. And hopefully, hopefully you guys go out and try to get this gun also for yourselves. Um, just to let you know, you do have to be ranked 3 in Ares Morn, the um, vendor for the Dark Below. And you have to have the Husk of the Pit upgraded by killing Hive only. And you get that, just to let you know real quick, by killing Blades of Crota. Do the Fist of Crota, guys, and it'll be much quicker for you. But everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a like down below. Subscribe for more. Edelin's Ally is an incredible, incredible legendary um, rifle. I cannot wait to see what the Necrochasm does. Because this gun is just, it's just, it was a surprise upgrade from the Husk to this. And um, I cannot wait to see what it does in the future, guys. But as always, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like down below. Subscribe for more if you're new to the channel. And just stopping by. And do you know what, guys? As always, this has been Too Bad 2, and I'll see you next time.